everyone. Time to get into it. NBA action on 2K Sports. I'm Kevin Harlan, joined by Chris Weber and Craig Anthony. David Aldridge is our sideline reporter. We'll see the Houston Rockets facing the Houston Rockets. Tip off goes to Houston. Here's the starting group for Houston. Westbrook and Harden, the dynamite pair. They're the backcourt. E.J. Tucker is out there with Robert Covington, and it's House in at the three spot. Now, here is Elijah Wan. Just five to shoot. Houston needs to get a shot up. Here's Yao. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. And Ming is, is mammoth in terms of his size. Exceptional at using it to snare those offensive rebounds. It's Westbrook with the drive. He gets it in there. And, and once he got to the 10, I, I think he was surprised to find himself that wide open. Yeah, very little resistance. I mean, you have to bring much faster help than that. Now here's Drexel. Rebound by House. And here's Houston. Here's Harden on the wing. It's Covington on the wing. Yow with the block. And you have to appreciate the reach of me. Superb at putting himself in a good position there to block the shot. Now here's Harden. And out of bounds as the Rockets gain possession. His shot was hindered by that momentous mobile one block. Some intimidation right away. Got to show those shooters you're going to be there all night long. Harden against Westbrook. The first quarter of action, two minutes in. It's good. Physical defense possible. They could have called a foul there. But Westbrook, he's a beast. He just plays right through it. Harden against Westbrook. Harden outside. Shot clock at six. That one drops for him. One of the best finishers inside, period. I mean, there's nowhere on the floor Harden can't score from. Pass to House. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Pass to Covington. McGrady against Harden. Or three, Westbrook. Rebound by Yao. So it's the Rockets now. Passes to Drexel. And the layup's good off the glass. I tell you what, it's it's almost like stealing to watch how he plays the game from this seat. Westbrook scanning the floor. Fires at the elbow. And that one off the back of the rim and in. Westbrook's got six points. And it's Harden with the ball for Houston. And here in the first quarter, with a little over three and a half minutes played, up and in on the way. Harden's got his second bucket of the game to go. Uh, quick and strong and determined. Harden has it all when it comes to scoring in the paint. The pass to House. Harden against McGrady. Harden outside. From deep. The shot comes out, and Houston the other way now. Here's McGrady, and he banks in the layup. Like the size McGrady has inside. Fantastic at kind of angling his body there for the interior shot. Westbrook finds Harden. To the wing on the left. Tucker the pass to House. Or three, Westbrook. The Rockets pull it in. 
Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sideline. Good evening, Kevin. I was able to talk with the Rockets' head coach. He talked about the importance of controlling where Russell Westbrook shoots from in this one. Coach said if we make him an outside shooter, that's a win for us. When he gets into the paint is when teams don't have an answer. So it looks like they'll invite Westbrook to shoot from deep as often as he wants. Guys? Thank you, David. Here is Harden following the basket by Russell Westbrook. Harden outside. He kicks to Drexler. Five on the clock. Shoots it. And the Rockets getting another bucket right there. The backcourt today as good as it gets. And, and they've earned the green light every time they touch the ball. Westbrook passes to Tucker. And oh, he blocked it and deflects off the backboard. Covington against Elijah Wan. Harden with it. He's got six. Russell Westbrook with the rebound. He's not an easy man to stop when he's attacking the basket. The D doing everything he can. And as it goes out of bounds, Houston able to keep the ball here. And now the first timeout called here for the Rockets. And team strategies closely guarded. One aspect of the game the fans aren't always privy to. Yeah, and sometimes it's the most subtle moves that make the biggest difference. Just five on the clock. Westbrook. Oh, and he plucks it off the glass. Wow. Inside. And Elijah Wan gets it to go on the assist by McGrady. And the Rockets lead by eight. Yeah, and you got to respect the size McGrady has. Easily seen over the defense there to spot the open man. To Westbrook. Westbrook double team. And a bit of a battle here for the ball. The official signals a jump ball here. And so here is Houston. Houston leading by eight. Harden surveying the D to the paint. Elijah Wong scored the basket, his second of two attempts. Yeah, they're going to have a nice little run here. Harden outside. Six on the shot clock. It's stolen by McGrady. And McGrady with a clear path to the hoop. Count that one. And it's a 12-point rocket lead. Their play on both ends has been superb. We, we'll see if they can maintain the momentum. Yeah, you got to be careful. It's still early. They've expended a lot of energy, but they've also built a nice cushion here. Basket counts. Way to showcase the court vision. Westbrook, I mean, he gets his teammates some wide open looks. Harden draws the double, feeds it to Yao. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they've shot the basketball. Westbrook against Harden. Westbrook drives in, gets it to drop, and now he's shooting at a five for eight clip. Oh, he's been dominant this quarter. I mean, he's determined to prevent the lead from getting any bigger. 
Westbrook against Harden. Pass to Yao. Down low. Here's Elijah Wan. That's in, and he's now three for three and looking sharp. Their interior has been inferior defensively. It has got to tighten up. Timeout called the Rockets. And the lack of rim protection, top of the list. Without question. They're giving up too many high percentage looks. A trend that they'd like to reverse. to Tucker. And so it looks like the Rockets will retain possession here. Harden outside. Westbrook against Harden. Six to shoot. Double team on Westbrook. And Tucker kicks to Gordon. And they've done a nice job controlling the defensive backboard to start this game. Harden against Covington. McGrady passes to Elijah Wan. And Harden gets it to go in on the assist by Trexler. Moving it around, eight of their last ten coming off assists. Harden scanning the floor. Outside Gordon. And Tucker kicks to West. Back to Tucker. Gordon the pass to Harden. And he's good on the three ball. Oh, and that catch and shoot Jay from Harden is unblockable. Just quickly shooting off the pass. Harden outside. Passes it to McGrady. Out of bounds. Houston takes possession. Westbrook against Harden. Double team on Westbrook. Now here's Tucker. Defense right on him. That cuts the lead to single digits. Tucker's got his second bucket. Makes a big difference when Tucker is hitting the mid-range J. I mean, it keeps the D off balance. Now Drexel. Let's a floater go. Rocket six. McGrady outside. Yao trying to break through. And that one's good. McGrady. McGrady's got nine. How about he has yet to miss 4-4 to start? Westbrook double team. To the middle. Here's Tucker. It's good. The assist that time from Harden. Six points for him. He's got the hot hand right now. As long as he can keep getting open, they've got to keep feeding him. The pass to Yao. Harden against McGrady. And there it is for him. Really seizing the momentum of this game, but doing it with a methodical approach. They decided to pound the ball inside, using their physicality to set the tone. And so it's Houston up by a dozen here at the end of the quarter. What a night they've had in terms of their shooting. Everything dropping in for them. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. And if 
you're just tuning in. We've got a wide margin on the scoreboard, but uh, plenty of time left for a comeback. In quite a position here for the Rockets to be in. What do you think, guys? Well, the offense is clicking, and they seem to have seized the momentum here early on. Yeah, how many coaches say, we want to start fast? Now, let's see if they can maintain that intensity. Rockets trail by 12. All fueled up and ready to go. Let's reset the lineups, courtesy of Gatorade, as the second quarter gets going. And so in the game for the Rockets. Harden and Gordon are out on the wing. Robert Covington out there with P.J. Tucker. And it's Westbrook in at the point. Westbrook's gone 6 of 9 from the field. Just three misses, shooting a terrific 67%. Back to Drexler. Pass to Murphy. Shot clock at 6. Here's Sampson. Elijah Wan trying to break free. Sampson's shot. Good. And guys, they continue to put a lot of pressure on the interior defenders with their work down low. Westbrook passes to Gordon. Pass to Harden. It's stolen by McGrady. Full reverse layup. McGrady's got the lead up to 14 now for Houston. And the combination of his quickness and soft touch around the rim really allows him to pull off shots like that. A lot of players don't have the reverse in their arsenal. Now, here is Harden. Six to shoot. Count the basket. He's a point guard. I mean, the point guard's command in the pick and roll. Harden, he always reads it perfectly. Drexler against Gordon. Drexler drawing the double team. Murphy passes to Elijah Wan. Stolen by Westbrook. And the foul called on Russell Westbrook. That is his first foul of the game. Rockets leading by 12. inside. He's covered by Westbrook. And Murphy kicks to Sampson. To the inside. And that one's good. McGrady. McGrady's got 15 points. And they're beginning to just flat out fall apart defensively right now. Especially on the interior. Elijah Wan with the block. Without a doubt, one of the most versatile shot blockers in the game. Elijah Wan does it in the painted area as well as along the perimeter. Now, here is Murphy. He's been patient so far. Nothing on the scoreboard yet. Kicks it to Drexler. Passes it to Murphy. Over Westbrook. Offensive rebound. Shots good by Drexler. Uh, unwilling to let up even for a moment. That's his killer instinct just fanning the flame. Oh, yeah, and that's what you love about him. He shows no mercy, even with the comfortable lead. Now, here is Harden. Five points in the game. Gordon with it. Picked up by Elijah Wan. Shoots the three. And uh, Akeem Elijah Wan pulls it down. Elijah Wan's got his fourth rebound in this one. He kicks to Murphy. And too much time in the lane. They get called for the three-second violation. Both teams deciding to change it up. So it's Covington who brings up the ball for Houston. It's a 14-point game. Double team on Westbrook. Now the pass to McLemore. Back to Westbrook. Pass to Tucker. Six on the shot clock. The kick out to Westbrook. For three. Looks good. Is good. Bucket number four from the field. He's taken only six shots. Not many folks thought that Tucker would have success as an NBA three-point shooter. But he's proven all of them wrong. He's got good range. Here's McGrady. Pass 
to Murphy. Hayes, bounce pass. Passes it to McGrady. Goes back up. Hayes trying to break through. And that one's good. McGrady. McGrady's got 17. You got to love seeing McGrady when he's hot. An amazing score from any spot on the floor. Murphy against Westbrook. Softly drops in the floater. Westbrook's got four points this quarter. As hot as he's been, it, it still has to be him who leads the charge and helps turn this game around. The pass to Sampson. His shot is good, making him a perfect two for two from the floor. Big miscommunication on defense. He recognizes it and quickly takes advantage. <laughs> yeah, they're pouring it on right here. Trying to give the opposition no light at the end of the time. Now here's Gordon. Still getting warmed up offensively. No scoring hit from him. Three-pointers off the mark. Houston leading by 13. Mug Frady with the ball. Now defended by McLemore. That's not who they want guarding him. I mean, the size mismatch is just too big. All he has to do is just keep attacking the rim. Westbrook passes to Gordon. And here's McLemore. Back to Gordon. Houston needs to get a shot. Or three, Westbrook. It's rebounded by Hayes. McGrady outside. Houston moving it around. And the shot goes down. Hayes has got his first two points. Yeah, that was the third straight high percentage look the defense has allowed. The, the defenders have got to start putting bodies on bodies. And Westbrook, here we go. Count it. The defense probably had a plan for Westbrook's drive, but he's so dynamic. I mean, it all falls apart. Samson shot, good. They're doing a really good job of getting the ball inside and attacking the paint. That's an area they have completely dominated. Timeout called the Rockets. Every timeout, a chance to review the lineups, matchups, or call a play. Now, that's what coaches are paid to do, right? I mean, curious to see what they go with here. making substitutions here. Green in the post. Working on Hayes. Green kicks to McLemore. Pass to Rivers. Shot clock at six. And block. That one goes careening off the glass. And Harden sent a message to the D with the block, really showing his extraordinary... Yao, the pass to Hayes. Yao trying to get open. The shot's good from Hayes. Well, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. They keep getting it in the paint and continue to score consistently. Now here's McLemore. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Gordon against McGrady. Green inside the three-point line. He clangs that one off the back iron, and down it falls. I mean, this is Gordon's offensive instincts going to work. I mean, feeds the open man the moment he spots him. Here's Harden. Hayes trying to break through. Harden's shot is good. Harden's got 10. And that's 10 straight points in the paint. The defense, nowhere to be found. Rivers surveying the D. 
Shoots from 12. And it's in after a nice bounce off the right side. Ooh, the lost art of the mid-range J. Gordon just measured it perfectly, squaring up and knocking it down. Here's Tom Janovich. Good. It's Harden with the assist that time. Harden's got four assists in the game. And even with the big lead, he remains focused on the task at hand. We talk about killer instinct all the time. He definitely has it. He's keeping his foot on the pedal here. Now here's Gordon. Back to Rivers. Pulls it from 20. And it's Tom Janovich with the rebound. Houston leading by 19 points. To the middle. A nice shot by Yao. He has six. And it just seems that every pass they make is leading to a score. Just great ball movement. And the Rockets with possession here. Here's McLemore. Still looking for his first bucket in this one. Back to Gordon. Over McGrady and the basket by Gordon. Such a talented offensive player. Gordon's shot selection is great. He's a terrific scorer. McGrady outside. Doesn't get it to drop for him. So Houston will take it the other way. Tucker the pass to Green. Rivers with it. Score of the basket. Nice shot after missing his first attempt. Smooth handles from Rivers right there. Sometimes he's capable of surprising you with some of his moves. Harden draws the double. Pass to Hayes. Back to Harden. On the wing, Tracy McGrady. Out of bounds. Houston takes possession. Moses Malone. He's checked in for the Rockets. Paul comes in for McGrady. And a change for the Rockets. Harden's checked in. Rockets trail by 17. It's nine seconds separating the shot clock and game. Rivers kicks to Harden. Good on the shot. Well, it's easy to see how Harden's been the league's top assist man before. I mean, he makes the special feeds. Harden against Harden. Now Harden. He's got 10. A three. And the last second attempt does not go in for him. And that does it for the first half of play. Rockets lead by 15. Stay with us, folks. We'll get back just after halftime to start the third quarter. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, welcome back to the NBA on 2K Sports. This is Ernie Johnson. Kenny the Jet Smith is right here. Say hey to the folks, Kenny. Hey, folks. Say hey to the yeah, folks, folks, Shaq. Hey, folks. Hey, folks. Hey, let's get this party started. Okay. Houston holding the upper hand after the first two quarters. They have a two-point lead. Kenny, give us your take. There's been one thing that's made a difference in this game above all else. Their control of the backboard. They put forth an amazing effort on the glass, and the rebounding numbers aren't even close, Ernie. That'll be something to keep an eye on in the second half. They will be very tough to contain if that continues. And Shaq, let's get your input on the Rockets. Well, not at all what they envisioned coming to the game. Uh, and defending the paint has been the main problem. You got to commit to more bodies down low. They got to protect the inside, protect the inside, protect the inside. And even if they do, it still might be a little too late for them, Ernie. And that's a wrap for our halftime show. The third quarter just about to get started. Wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. We're seeing a tremendous game from Tracy McGrady. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. Yeah, working the ball, getting clean, quality looks. I mean, just efficient basketball through and through. 
and with a big gap on the scoreboard, the second half begins with very different goals for these teams. One side trying to mount a comeback, one side trying to project their lead. They've got Tracy McGrady. Elijah Wan is out there with Drexel. Then it's Harden, and it's Yao in at the five down low. That's the five for Houston right now. Six to shoot. Covington kicks to house. From the arc. Rebound by Yao. Yao's got six rebounds here tonight. Well, they've been better than good on the glass today, and there is a glaring discrepancy between these two teams in that area. They're taking it right into the teeth of the defense and, and it's a defense that's starting to look frustrated oh yeah it, it, it's getting to the, the lack of communication the lack of trust here is house no points in the game yet for him and Harden with the basket on the assist by house well we've seen that movie a few times haven't we an easy bucket in the paint Harden bounce pass Elijah one inside, defended by Covington. Here's Harden for the basket. It's number six for him this game. Six for nine, 67% shooting. It's a great move, and he catches the defense completely off guard. You'd like to see a little more energy coming out of halftime with the defensive. Tucker, Yao with the block. Here's Harden on the wing. He's covered by Westbrook. And here's Drexler. He's got six. Kicks it to Hart. Let's the three fly. Picked the wide by Houston. And Yao gets it to go. They're on target from the start of the half. I mean, they're moving well. They're getting some good shots. Now that makes them three for four from the field since halftime. Now here's Harden. Seven points in the game. over two and a half minutes off the clock in this final half of play. Off target at the rim. It's still early, but a one for four start to the half, that's a bad sign if you ask me. They've got a can't miss play. Now's the time to break the glass and pull it out. And that's just too deep. Uh, Elijah Wine with way too many moves in there, almost automatic. Timeout called the Rockets. They're trying to stem the tide here. Uh, yeah, they have to regroup and, and revisit their strategy at the defensive end. Three minutes into the second half. Westbrook against Harden. To the paint. Here's Tucker. And that comes off the assist by Russell Westbrook. Tucker's got 13. I mean, it's evident that Tucker likes trying his luck inside. He has the size, weight, toughness, and touch to be effective. Now, here is Harden. 12 points for him. Good on the bucket. And defensively, guys, they've been unable to shut down the middle. And here's Westbrook. He'll bring it up for Houston. We've gone about three and a half minutes into the third now. Pulled the shot a little left, but the bounce goes his way. 18 points for him. Oh, pretty comfortable mid-range shooting. You can't let Westbrook get in the groove from there. Down low. And Elijah Wan gets it to go on the assist by Harden. Harden's got six assists now in the game. Westbrook against Harden. Westbrook kicks to house. Back to Westbrook. 
Pass to Harden. Lock at six. And he comes up with the deuce. And Harden loves getting contact on his shots, showing off his true muscle and level of concentration. Harden outside. And he uses the glass on the layup. Harden's got four this quarter. His teammates keep getting him the ball in his favorite spots. He's done a lot for his shooters. Now here's Westbrook. 18 points for him. House kicks to Harden. the three. That's in for his fifth make of the night. Now shooting at a 50% clip. Five for ten. Wow, his first triple of the second half gives him two on the night. He's not making much of an impact from deep. There's the pass to Yao. And the rejection by Harden. And the ball travels out of bounds. It was last touched by Harden. We have got to see that sensational mobile one block again emphatic with the rejection. You've got to appreciate that kind of forceful defense. Houston making a switch. Smith has checked in. Damari Carroll's checked in for the Rockets. At the elbow, Smith... Grady outside. Shot clock at five. Here's Drexler. The Rockets again can't hit. Oh, their movement is good, and they get the ball into the right hand. Now, usually, he drops those in between jumpers. And let's catch up with our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Kevin, thank you. Now, we have seen continued growth with the NBA's affiliated leagues the last few years. Think about the explosion in popularity of the WNBA, the Basketball Africa League, expansion of the 2K League, greater pay in the WNBA, and the G League pathway, along with the unionization of G League players. The league continues to show its commitment to expanding opportunities on multiple levels. Guys, back to you. Thank you, David. The Rockets shooting their first free throw of the game. And so he hits the technical free throw. Houston making a switch. to shoot. Smith the pass to Drexler. Shoots over Covington. Here's Yao. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. Yao's got 12 in the game. And you got to appreciate the skill set Ming brings to the table. Knows no one can match up against them and simply lofting these inside shots up and in. Now here's Covington. outside out left to the wing Westbrook with a wide open look no good with the triple that's a look you cannot pass up it's also one you should miss yeah it's good again in the next one seven for eight shooting night so far oh, good look there as well and this is what Hakeem's worked on pay too much attention to him and he'll burn you with a nice find now here's Covington Here's Tucker. And here's Westbrook from the arc. The Rockets again can't hit. His field goal percentage has dipped this quarter. I mean, his movement has to be better. He has to find the open spot from the floor. The shot's good from Yao. He's putting the hammer down. Dominant quarter for him, trying to push out that lead. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. Westbrook with it. 18 points for him. Over Smith. And Westbrook gets it to go. Westbrook's got 20. Yeah, Westbrook is really racking up for I mean, The focus he's brought to this game is just incredible. Now 
Kyle Drexel. He has seven. To the wing right side. Here's Francis. Lays it up off the glass. And they've had assists now on their last three baskets. Smith against Westbrook. Yes, that goes in. Westbrook's got six here in this quarter. Oh, showing the muscle right there. I love how Westbrook takes on all comers when he's trying to score. Drexler against Covington. Whistle blows, but that's going to be a travel. That's one of the few mistakes they've made tonight. They've limited turnovers. That's helped them grow this lead and keep it. Moses Malone. He's checked in for Yao. Gordon's checked in for the Rockets. And here's Harden. He's got 12. Harden draws the double. Inside. Pass to Gordon. The three. It's rebounded by Houston. Here's Francis. Smith on the wing. Pass to Malone. It's good, the assist that time from Smith. Malone's got his first points in this one. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket, coming off a pretty pass. Here's Westbrook. That shot off. Smith with some nice D. Passes it to Francis. Great pass to set up the lay-in. Francis has got four points in the quarter. And the crisp passing has opened things up for them offensively. Now, here's Westbrook. 22 points for him. And the pass to Harden. Steps back and shoots. And he buries that one, drilling the rim on the way down. And this is what you get with the beard. I mean, he takes pride in nailing tough shots over the defense. Smith on the wing. He's covered by Westbrook. Smith the pass to Francis. Houston moving it around. Here's Elijah one, and it's Houston with another. Yeah, the chemistry has been terrific. Really impressed with their offensive execution. Harden outside. 24 seconds left to play in the third. Unloads from 13. Francis grabs the board. Smith surveying the D. He dishes it to Drexler. And the official signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. Here is Harden. Here's Tucker. Malone with the block. And how about the quicks there by Malone to get up and deter that shot, utilizing that size and reach for the rejection. And so it's the Houston Rockets holding a very comfortable 25-point lead as the quarter comes to a close. The scoring has been tremendous, and they are shooting lights out with very high accuracy. We'll get right back to the action when we return. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? And the definition of teamwork right there, guys. I mean, what great communication between them, and what a beautiful feat. I mean, well, if you're the coaching staff, I mean, you're pumped up. This highlight will not only make it on the TV, it'll make it into the film session. And as we head into the fourth, we'll see if there's a comeback in the works or if it's more of the same from the first three quarters. Taking a look at the Rockets, they've got Green. Austin Rivers is out there with Ben McLemore, and it's Chandler, and it's House, and at the three, the small forward. Here's Francis, down to five on the shot clock. Over House. They get it back, Tom Janovic. And there's the bucket, stay with it on the offensive glass, getting it done. Yeah, these defenders just look a bit overmatched, especially inside. 
here's Rivers. Solid play in the low block, and that one's good. A crafty finisher. Rivers has a lot of confidence going to that floater when he's given a chance. Pass to Francis. Now here's Malone. He's guarded by Chandler. Malone against Chandler. Malone's shot. Good. And I really, I want to see more of that from him. I mean, he's been passing up on his shot more than usual, even though he's hitting the ones that he takes. Now here's Rivers. Outside, Green. To the middle, Chandler. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Chandler's got his first pass. And Green is a critical role player for this team. His passing is really phenomenal. Elijah Wan against Green. And the basket by Elijah Wan. And really the story of this second half. One team getting the shots they want. The other, not so much. Yeah, you can clearly see which offense is better right now. We'll see if that continues the rest of the way. Now here's McLemore. And stolen by Malone. Just a little under two and a half minutes have passed now here in the fourth. Yep, it counts. That's just the product of good pass work. I mean, nice team basketball right there. Rivers against Paul. Up top, Rivers. He kicks it to McLemore. Just four to shoot. Over Francis. And a kind roll that time off the rim as that one falls. And so it's Paul bringing it up for the Houston Rockets. Shot clock at six. Malone outside. Here's Francis. No good from outside. Got the defender off his feet with the pump fake, but couldn't knock it down. Rivers against Paul. Pass to Elijah Wan. Here's Tom Janovich. And it's off from three-point range. Here's House. A strong finish under heavy pressure all over. Here's Paul. Passes it to Francis. Six on the shot clock. Elijah Wan against Green. Bucket is good. Elijah Wan's got four points now in the quarter. It's no wonder why they're in front when you take into consideration that he's been perfect from the field so far. Rivers dishes to McLemore. And there's the whistle. Three-second violation. Oh, costly error there. We'll see how they rebound from that miscue. Man, when you're playing from behind, that's the last thing you want to do. To make matters worse. And the ball's tied up, so we'll have a jump ball. The Rockets with the ball. Green with the ball. Dishes it to Rivers. Back to Green. Over Murphy. And Green with the basket on the assist by Rivers. Uh, uh, there is the unselfishness that coaches love so much. Rivers doing a great job getting it to the open man. Ball outside. Sinks that one from the post. Paul's got his first points of the game. And a good read right there by Paul. Great at carving out space close to the rim and capitalizing. Rivers kicks to Green. Malone with the block. And it's Houston on the break. There's the pass to Tom Janovich. Now Paul. Pass 
to Murphy. Five to shoot. Over McLemore. And it's Houston with another. And look at how quick he was to bite on the pump fake. Left his feet way too soon. They've been struggling here on offense. Yeah, a bit of a dry spell for sure. Rivers passes to Green. Chandler up top. Green breaking loose. A nice shot by Rivers. And it's six points for Austin Rivers. One item that stood out, their ball movement. Things are definitely clicking. And more importantly, it makes it really hard to defend. Now, here is Murphy. Count that bucket. Murphy's got four this quarter. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. Yeah, very aggressive. I mean, he takes on the challenge with no hesitation. Rivers finds Green. Pass to McLemore. Now here's Rivers for the three. Sinks the three-pointer. Oh, it's big when Rivers connects from outside. Really helps space the entire floor for a squad. And here's Murphy. Passes to Paul. Al Malone. Over Chandler. But they'll get another chance. Kicks to Murphy. Tries again. And it's good on the way up. Given the size disadvantage, you have to have a lot of confidence to take that shot. Yeah, no question. It takes skill and a certain level of fearlessness. Now here's Rivers. There's the dish to McLemore. Chandler outside. Off target from outside. Not quite enough defense that time around. Just lucky he was off. And Malone gets double teamed. And the pass to Hayes. Malone trying to break free. A shot's good from Hayes. Great decision. Great find. I mean, draws the double team and passes out of it to create the open look. Pass to House. Back to McLemore. Fires from the wing. And a little luck that time, but it drops. Green's got four this quarter. And a smooth jump shot from the veteran Green there. These are looks he nails consistently. Paul looking around. There's the triple. Unable to get that one. And so it's Houston with it. Here's Rivers. Shot from the top of the key. It's rebounded by Houston. Tom Janovich has got his fifth rebound right now in the game. Now here is Murphy. And Chandler sends it back. And how about the basketball IQ of Chandler? Just knows exactly when to sky and commit to blocking shots. For the Rockets, Samson's checked in, and Smith subbed in for Chris Paul. And Baamute's checked in for the Rockets. Cephalosha comes in for Daniel House. Off the inbound, and Smith puts it in. Great job of screening there. Nice job to take it to the rim and get the finish. Rivers against Smith. Rivers kicks to Cephalosha. Pass to Mba Amute. Lock at six. Passes it to Rivers. Over Smith. Rivers can't get it to go. And it's Smith with the ball. He brings it up for the Houston Rockets. Now the pass to Sampson. Go, 
over Rivers. Samson's shot is off. Even when the D is playing off of him, the mid-range jumper shouldn't be the shot they're looking for. Now here's McLemore. He's guarded by Murphy. McLemore with the ball. Let's it go from deep. And it's Tom Janovich with the rebound. Smith outside. So we see Houston taking the W here. And the outcome of this one was never in doubt. And boy, they really put in a supreme effort. Uh, it just felt like once they had that lead and it was comfortable, they were not going to relinquish it. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Greg Anthony, Chris Weber, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. Thanks for watching the NBA, presented by 2K Sports. So long and good night, everyone. Thank <laughs> you.